a deadly church attack in France carried out in the name of ISIS. A deadly hostage-taking situation at a Catholic church in Normandy, in which a priest was killed and another person seriously wounded, was a terrorist attack. French President François Hollande has said. Speaking to journalists in the northern French town of saint étienne de ravre where two men took five people hostage during morning mass, Holland said the attack was a cowardly assassination carried out by two terrorists in the name of Daesh, another name for ISIS. In the latest Islamist atrocity to France, an 84-year-old Catholic priest, the Reverend Jacques Hamel, was killed when two men stormed the church in the northern region of Normandy, besides the slain priest, two nuns and two churchgoers had been taken hostage. One of the hostages was seriously wounded and is between life and death. The situation ended when the two attackers were shot dead by police, the two killers came out and they were neutralized. The priest's killing comes on the back of a string of violent attacks across Europe in recent days, some claimed by the Sunni terror group ISIS, most notably an attack in the French city of Nice less than two weeks ago that it left 84 dead. France has been under a state of emergency since the Paris terror attacks in November last year. A French police said that one of the church attackers had tried to go to fight in Syria last year but had been stopped in Turkey by authorities there. He was then sent back to France and sent to prison in May 2015 before he was released, placed under police surveillance and forced to wear an electronic monitoring tag. French authorities have struggled to monitor the thousands of domestic Islamic radicals on their radar and, in response to the heightened terror threat, French President François Hollande has vowed to double the number of officials charged with the task. More than 10,000 people are on their fiches list, used to flag radicalized individuals considered a threat to national security. Speaking to reporters, Hollande said. Daesh has declared war on us. We have to win that war. But he urged the public to remain unified in the face of the threat. All people feel affected, so we must have cohesion, no one can divide us. Terrorists will not give up on anything until we stop them. He expressed his thoughts for Catholics and also met with special forces personnel who responded to the attack. The Paris anti-terror prosecutor has taken over the investigation, France's interior ministry said in a statement. Report by John Stone for On The Go News.